Hello, welcome to Let's Play Halo 4, and we need to blow some more stuff up. Yeah, we are currently in the middle of a gondola mission. There's explosive barrels on my boat. That's not good. Yeah, we are, we're going to have to clear these little thingies to get on our gondola so we can keep moving. Which means the pacing of, our le of this level is going to be kind of slow. Normal levels, you can kind of breeze through it, but levels like this basically they exist to slow you way the hell down. Oh, hi. Hmm, yeah, I'll, this gun's probably better here. We're getting in more into close quarters. No matter what they say on uh, Alien, in Halo games, shotgun is not the thing you use for close encounters. That's all a rifle is. Shotgun's what you use for knife fights. Actually, really, this game. It I'm still disappointed by the fact that here, the shotgun is only really useful at ranges where you might as well be hitting them with the butt of your gun. It's like a butt stroke that uses ammunition, which makes it extra useless. Or rather requires ammunition. Wait, did that guy shrug off a grenade? He stood in the grenade field, then took it for several seconds, and all we did is burn off his shield. I mean, to be fair, it works the same way for me, but still. You... Fresh Storm Rifle. I'm going to clear this whole area before I hit the button. Yeah, I think that's everybody. Unless we get some BS last minute response as soon as I hit the button. We're in bit. Back to the gondola. They're moving it for where did those guys come from? Like I said, see what I said about BS response. How am I supposed to get down there? Ah, okay, they're using the Promethean Knights because they can teleport. Okay, I'll cut you some slack for that. Ooh, I'm actually going to be pistol whipping these guys. <clears throat> There we go, that was actually... And now the explosive barrels aren't on my ship anymore to cause me problems later.
the shield recharge. Need to shoot. Obnoxious assholes hanging onto a wall. There's a knight on you. There's a knight. That pistol is terrible. Really, really terrible. Okay, start us back up. Don't have to tell me twice. Once I reload an ammunition, that is. Now, is that the only one, or are we going to have... We have a second one up ahead, on, this time on the left, don't we? Oh, boy. They're not going to make this easy, are they? No, they're not. Personally, just preferred having them just respawn on spawn on the gondola. I don't have to fight them here, but no, that would that that would short make the level too short. We can't have too short of a level. No, we need to pad this sucker. Well, I just shot it, unless there's more of them. Ah, oh, there they are. Well, hopefully you can get through all the padding by the end of this video. Trying to lock out the gondola controls again. Well, we'll see. Well, um, three for three industries. Your level design decisions um, switch between. I don't know what they switch between. It's, it, it, there's there's no between. It's just padding. I mean, I like the gameplay of this game, but good lord. This is fun to play, but just in terms of commentating on it, I mean, even, when I was, even when I was playing this, it wasn't. It was this. This is a slog. Particularly with the ever shifting color cover. That's, no, that's helpful. You shot it over there.
Well, congratulations, the game you've succeeded at irritating me. Or, yeah. And I'm dead. Oh, really? This far back? Cortana, are you hearing him? No. Didact? I'm sorry, but Halo 5, which I'm probably not going to play because it's continuing this, continuing this really dumb story, needs to work on its checkpointing. General thumb for checkpoints is about every five, ten minutes or so. Every five or ten minutes, and every every time you beat a major group of enemies. Just because you never know when someone's going to have to put down the game. Oh, but it, and this is put down due to having to go get the door, having to walk the dog. Kids have um, need help with something. Um, need to sign a package. Need to take someone to the hospital. Life happens, man. And honestly, I think a, a thing game designers probably should keep in mind. It, when, when handling checkpoints is to recognize that life happens and to put checkpoints in a fashion that accommodates, you know, life. Because life don't come before games. Games are awesome, but life don't come before games. I mean, unless games are your means of employment, which pays for life, or the stuff related to life, then we can get into debatable argument. But anyway, we're, we're, we're here to talk about Halo. We're not here to talk about economics and philosophy and that sort of thing. We'll say that for the baristas. Oh, hi, doggy. Let's check it the night again. Just keep respawning, or is there actually a finite number of you in this level? Okay, let's go up and get that freaking thing hit. Oh, and now you're protecting the dogs, too. I do just we're, we're all about the, all the uh, all about the Promethean Knights. All right, about time to wrap this one up. Next time we'll push the button and hopefully be done with this padding. And I will see you then.